What's up, guys? Uh, Matt Squeaky Clean Air uh, here, or Squeaky Clean, another vlog. So, you've just did, got some stickers done, you have your really cool designs, but the biggest problem with uh, die cut stickers or decals is that usually the edges lift, especially when you use like a microfiber cloth and you're cleaning your windows. The edges have a tendency to lift and then they start to peel away. One of the tricks that I found um, that you can sort of <clears throat> prevent it from lifting a lot is especially at the corners, especially when you have short corners, is just trim the corners so so they don't lift as much. It's usually the really, really sharp corners are the ones that lift very much. So this is one trick that I found that works really well um, for getting rid of that issue. I'll demonstrate in just a second. So here's a really good example of what I'm talking about, and it happens to be on uh, the decal uh, that I applied myself of uh, Engage Arrow. So this over here is that corner. So anytime you're going to be using a cloth or anything like that, you, you're always going to have these corners that are lifting. So a simple trick that I've done is basically trim them and cut them. But the thing is, is you don't want to cut it right on the window because you don't want to scar your window in, in any way. You know, it would be just as simple as taking a knife and cutting it a little bit in order to get rid of the the edge over here, and that way it won't uh, it won't lift as much because it's not a sharp corner. But the problem is, never ever take a blade. Remember, never ever take a blade, and then just apply it directly to your glass. And the reason why you you don't want to do that is because when you take the blade and you scar or you um, you know um, cut your 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 grass uh, glass, not grass. Um, what happens is you're creating a small little pit. If you're going to be getting any sort of temperature changes, if you're driving all year and your windshield, you know, freezes, that's another stress point that it might crack at. So what I do is I usually put one of these guys underneath, which is a squeegee. Just take that little corner there and then trim it and chop it off. And that's a really good way of getting rid of the edges. But try never, ever... Or any, any flat piece will work, even like a razor blade that you can put under and then use the knife. So basically you have a cushion between your knife and the windshield. Never ever apply a blade on your windshield because you're going to pit your windshield and then your windshield might actually crack. I've learned this the hard way and I'll never ever do it again. So there you go. A little bit of a trim. Um, I didn't apply the blade directly to the glass. Um, but that will prevent it, you know, from far. You don't even know the, notice the difference on the actual graphic. I guess I could modify the graphic and uh, get rid of the uh, sharp corners, and uh, that way it'll be less likely for it to uh, to lift. But the main thing is, don't ever use a sharp blade directly onto glass because you're pitting it, and then what happens is you can create a stress crack, especially when there's changes of temperature or when you hit anything. That's when your that's where your glass is going to shatter. So. Uh, make sure you don't ever apply a blade directly to glass, but that's a good quick way of, of getting rid of the corners um, Especially when they lift when you're using a rag 